The former deputy governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria and the presidential aspirant of the Young Progressives Party, YPP, Professor Kingsley Mogalu, has reacted to the blockage of the National Assembly by operatives of the Department of State Services, DSS. In a chat with On TV, the presidential aspirant described the action as undemocratic against principles of a modern society. He explained that the invasion of the National Assembly by the DSS tells the world that Nigeria is fast becoming a failed state. The events of today at the National Assembly um, are very, very ominous. And they tell us that this country is in a crisis. We're becoming a failing state. The rule of law is collapsing under the presidency of Muhammad Buhari. Our legislators are absent from duty. What type of democracy are we practicing? What do our security agencies do to protect Nigerians? They are failing to protect Nigerians, but they're very busy protecting the regime. Why should the security agencies try to prevent members of the National Assembly from gaining entrance to the legislative chambers? What is going on in Nigeria? Let me tell you, between what has happened today and all these defections across party lines from APC to BDP and those defecting from BDP to APC, they tell us only one thing. The time has come for Nigerians to turn their back on the APC and the PDP. They are one and the same. The APC is a kettle, the PDP is a pot. They're both black. There is no salvation for Nigeria. All these politicians are simply looking for their own stomach, their convenience, their comfort. The YPP presidential aspirant says enough is enough and asks Nigerians to execute political revolution through the ballot. Nigerians should just say to themselves, look, Enough is enough. We want to make progress like other countries in the world that are making progress. Nigeria is not supposed to be living in the Stone Age and people are playing Stone Age politics instead of providing leadership that will free our people from poverty and bondage. None of these cross capitals, none of this barricading of the National Assembly, none of it is in the interest of the common man. I say it is time. It is time for Nigerians to rise up and execute a political revolution at the ballot box in a democratic vote in 2019. It is time for a new breed of leaders to come up and take Nigeria into the 21st century. We've had enough of this stone age politics that's going on in this country. We need leadership, real leadership. Professor Mogalu praised the Vice President Yumi Shibato for the sack of the DSS boss, Lawal Daura. I mean, we've witnessed uh, since this government came into power uh, an increasing propensity for impunity on the part of the um, state security services. We've seen it time and time again, and today was another demonstration of it. So if the acting president, in his judgment, fired the uh, head of the state security service, then all well and good. Let that be at least one good thing they have done in this government, one correct thing. You can't have the state security agencies operating above the laws of Nigeria. It's not right. It's just not right. But this is what we have seen in President Buhari's regime. Consistently, court orders will be issued. This government will ignore court orders, as if this country does not have any rule of law. Of course, we don't have in reality because this government has, has squashed the rule of law. They have sat on top of the rule of law, and it is time for them to be voted out of office. Meanwhile, National Chairman of the APC, Comrade Adam Sushomele, says attempts to pin the invasion of the National Assembly complex by DSS operatives on the party are mischievous. 